says, I've got the right to take him. <laughs> he was always going to do that, wasn't he? Also, when you, you look at this match, you have to think also you know, psychologically, it's still Brisbane, massive favourites to win the Premier's plate, but you can think of the finals time as well. to Tony Popovich, uh, Jade North, brought up to his feet by the Wanderers coach, Miranda from Ante College. Saved by Tony Popovich. stronger but it's actually Brisbane that have picked up. Might will be very happy with his, with his performance. Not in a pure footballing sense. Certainly the defensive structure they've almost got it perfectly right. A chance for Brent for the set piece. Rising well with Pontiac. Barisha. He's a man for late drama. You can see by the reaction they're happy with the point. Are going straight for the corner flag, they know a point's good enough. I think there'll be time now. Perhaps a, a few seconds beyond the three minutes added on. No, says the referee Chris Griffiths Jones, but it ends up 1 1 at Pertex Stadium. Brisbane were eyeing off their first victory against the Wanderers in Parramatta, courtesy of Bessar Barisha's. Uh, Expertly taken goal, but it was Lavanov Haliti giving the home side hope with a brilliantly taken effort of his own. And it gave rise to all three points for the home side, but uh, Brisbane came back and showed their skill and their quality tonight. Yusuf Hersey uh, was dynamic for Western Sydney, but couldn't break through. Tom Urich came on late. And Wanderers fans will go home uh, perhaps a little bit disappointed final score at Pertex Stadium Western Sydney 1 at Brisbane Raw 1 it's now down to Tom Tepper yeah, thank you Max, we're now joined by the man who scored that, uh, that equaliser late in the match Lavano Haliti, a lab, uh, pretty good time to score your first of the season mate yeah look I've been close a few times this year but obviously tonight came off and it went in so it's good after all that, after 90 minutes do you think maybe a point's fair enough? Uh, look, I thought it was a great game tonight. I think both teams had a go at each other. Obviously, they had one more, so we'll just move on. And after all said and done, I guess the, the race for the Premier is played still on. Yeah, of course, but we just get, take one game at a time and then concentrate on next week and, yeah, basically get back on Monday and start working again. Love and all. Well done. Thank you. Cheers. About to be joined by Brisbane captain Matty Smith. Uh, Matty, what's the feeling after that one? Disappointment to concede late, perhaps? Oh, disappointed to concede, but I think on the balance of play, we uh, we, we, we just could match them tonight. I, did it, I thought full credit must go to Western Sydney. They certainly come at us, made it very, very difficult for us. 
We defended very well at times, but um, I was very disappointed to, to concede like the way that we did. It was a very physical and fiery match. Did you expect that coming into a top of the table clash? Yeah, of course. I mean, when when, when, when two of the best teams in the league go for the points in a in a very good crowd here on a nice pitch, I've got no drama with that. So, uh, as far as I'm concerned, that's um, that's part of the game. And there's a lot of talk before the game that's uh, potentially, if you had a claim of three points, you're pretty much wrapped up the, pre the Premier's plate. But I guess it just maintains the status quo. You're still seven points clear, pleased? Yeah, yeah, of course. I mean, we're going to be pleased that we're seven points clear, but we're not. I, I'm certainly not happy with the, with the overall um, performance tonight. I didn't think. Um, I thought that we had to dig deep at times, but um, I think that we could have uh, done certainly better in um, a number of areas. Matty, thank you. Well done. Thanks. Yeah, Matt Smith there.